morning. Welcome in lessons online for a Sindibad school. English language for grade 8 by Basil Ali. Lecture number 12. We have two things in this lecture. We have uh, activity book, lesson 10, A, page 90. And we have a student book, roundup, page 70. First of all, I'm trying to finish all things which is not completed in unit six in order to begin with unit seven in the next lecture. We have here in, in uh, page uh, 90 activity book, we have this table and we have to full uh, in this uh, table like number one the title uh, and this is about the story time of course the title is about Bob and Basim the basketball characters you know Bob Basim Paul number three what is it about it's about basketball which hits Bob's nose. Two, what they want to be in the future. We have two things here. And number three, uh, number four, we have uh, why I like it or I didn't like it. Of course, I like it. I liked it because it is a funny story. And we always found that uh, Bob uh, have uh, bad luck. And the new words, the new words here, they, these are the new words. Embarrassed, trainers, public courts, entomologist, entomologist, ducted, camp. Okay. Now, we go back to the activity book and we try to uh, see what is there in page uh, 70 roundup. Of course, here we have uh, when we talk about jobs, saying what jobs people do. And we saw that many definitions of jobs were there in the previous pages, like those in page 62, okay? We have here, what is this man doing? He's trying to repair a car, so he's a mechanic. And uh, in picture two, what is this man doing? Or what is this person trying to do? He's managing or trying to draw things, so he is an architect, he's designing. He's designing. Um, something for uh, buildings. Number two, uh, talking about school subjects. My favorite school subjects are, and we can say, uh, my, my favorite school subject are history, uh, English language, Arabic, geography, and so on. I am good at geography and English. I'm bad at mathematics. So whenever we talk about these things, you have to follow these steps and these models. Number three, describing future events and plans that are certain. And as we said before, we use uh, the, the 
pattern of going on plus uh, B uh, B going on plus uh, base verb in order to describe something which is which we, we are sure that is going to to be done in the future. When I finish school, I am going to be a nurse. Notice that she is sure that when she finishes school, she is going to be a nurse. She is, or I am going to be a nurse, or they are going to be nurses. Notice here, when I finish school, I'm going to go to college. I am going, I'm going to go to college. And he is going to go to college, or we are going to go to college. You, you have done no work, you are doing to fail the exam. You've done no work, you are going to fail the exam. You are going to fail the exam. It's going rain to rain soon. He is sure that he is going that it is going to rain. Why? Because the sky is cloudy. And this is uh, this uh, I hope you good luck and goodbye thank you